Japan, Stephanie Becker. You can see exactly why the arena is full here tonight. This is a match with major stakes. Such a talented competitor. I think we're about to see one of her best matches yet. Absolutely cutthroat competitor. Here comes Dakota Kai. Looking ready to assert her control. And representing damage control from Auckland, New Zealand, Dakota Kai. She's got a ruthless attitude, ruthless kicks, all in the name of damage control. The captain of Team Kick is long gone. She is now the assassin of damage control. Yeah, the chip on her shoulder has grown even larger since coming back to WWE. Dakota Kai might not be the biggest superstar in the women's division, but her offense is another story. Devastating kicks and strikes, unrelenting aggression. Don't judge a book by its cover because Dakota is as dangerous as it comes. You definitely don't want to be on the receiving end of a Dakota Kai kick. And across the ring from her, Asuka. There are few superstars who can match or even meet the explosive offense of the Empress. There is no denying that, Corey. Trying to even match Asuka's energy is going to run your tank dry real fast. Some people might argue that trying to hobble your opponent is a little desperate. Those people obviously haven't been in the ring, Saxton. Corey, Asuka is such a dominant competitor. It's hard to find flaws, but what do you think is her biggest weakness? Well, if you ask Asuka, she doesn't have any weakness. And she'll yell at you, too. And that's just it. Asuka is confident and angry. The key to taking Asuka down is to use her cockiness to your advantage. Just wait for any opening because she and her ego will eventually create one. Is it enough? And she's not done yet. Impressive to not even allow a two count at this juncture. Face wash. What now? Belly stop. Oh. She's starting to look concerned. A ferocious Dakota coming out here. And it looks like she wants to take this match outside. Ah, snapmare takedown and a, oh, right to the spine. Dakota now with the upper hand. Like I said, all you had to do was wait for an opening. Asuka's not so dominant anymore, is she? Arm ringer, punch to the face. Dakota Kai with the crucifix chokehold submission. A couple of knees and then another one, and that'll force the break. Beautiful arm ringer applied, followed by a Larry ring to the face. There are a lot of ways this can go sideways. Everything on that stage looks like it hurts. 
All right, she's back in, ready to go. And Asuka is showboating right now. Dakota Kai off the ropes. The chiropractor. Wow. Has Dakota settled this? Two. What a kick out at two. Asuka with that warrior within, showing just how difficult it is to keep her down. And that could have been Dakota's best shot at putting this one away. Able to avoid there. She's looking for the win. Forces the shoulder up after two. She just will not go away. Asuka looking to go airborne. Oh, big mistake there, Corey. <laughs> she knows that now. Can you believe this? I love it. Solid contact from Dakota Kai. She shoots up the top rope. Dangerous thinking. From the top, Dakota from way up north. That's gotta be it. Two. No, she kicks out. A long two and a half in the waning moments of this match. Dakota Kai with the... Crucifix chokehold submission. Perhaps thinking something else here. Not sure why though, Michael. She seemed to have it really cinched in. Dakota with plans on ending this. Arm ringer. Bang! What a punch. Oh, she counters right back on Kai. Series of elbows looking to create separation. She does so. Double underhook carefully applied, muscling up their opponent. Butterfly backbreaker. This looks bad for Kai. Cover. No, she kicks out. She kicks out. Hope stays alive for Dakota Kai. Asuka needs to redial that trademark intensity of hers as that last attack was clearly not enough. These women have not given each other any breathing room. No one is showing any signs of backing down. Kick to the gut. This is not going to end well for their opponent. Oh, the package powerbomb. Asuka can taste it now. doing what she does best, there is no truer statement than no one's ready for Asuka.